In this video, I'm going to show you how to determine the break-even price of an item that you are selling on eBay. And in order to do this, we first must understand how the profit of an item is determined on eBay. And the profit that you make on an item is equal to the price of the item, or rather the payment that you're actually going to receive for the item, minus the fees that you will pay to eBay and PayPal, and, and then again, minus the total cost of the actual item. And when I say total cost, I mean the cost of acquiring or getting the item, and also the cost of getting the item out to your buyer, which would mean the shipping cost as well. Right, so we need to know uh, these three things to determine the profit. Now, the break even simply means when the profit of the item is zero, when the profit is going to be zero, right? Meaning we don't make any money and we don't lose any money. Now, this is a the actual math to determine that is it's a little bit complicated, but I've already done that math for you and I've derived a break even price formula. Now, the formula is broken down into two main parts. Um, it is a division formula, but on the, the left of the formula, you have to add the total cost of the item plus the PayPal transaction fee. Okay, that's one part. And then you're going to divide that by this whole section on the right, which is the which is one minus the eBay fee percent minus the PayPal fee percent. So whatever percentage you pay for eBay, whatever percentage you pay for your PayPal, okay, we're going to subtract those from one, okay? So you'll have an answer here, you'll have an answer here, and then you'll do division. Now, I'm going to show you how to do all of this in Excel, and I will even uh, share a Google Sheet with you to make this a lot easier. But I want you to see how this works, so I'm going to actually uh, build the formula here right in front of you. So I'll just zoom this in one more time. Let's start off with the total cost. Let's say you have determined that the, your total cost for an item is, uh, let's say, $50. So I'll type 50, which is 50. I've already formatted this with the dollar sign. And now I'm going to put the eBay fee percent. Right? One thing you can do here is format it as a percent first. Let's say it's a 10% eBay fee. And let's say my PayPal fee, okay, I'm, again, I'm going to format this as a percent, is 2.9% plus a transaction fee of 30 cents, okay, the standard. All right, and that's my PayPal transaction fee. Now I'm going to use this formula to determine the break even uh, price. And so I'm going to do equal open parentheses and first I will have in fact what I'm going to do is zoom this in even more I'm gonna really really zoom this up so you can really okay maybe that was just a little bit too much so you can really see this and I'm going to say equal first of all the total cost of the item Let's scroll back as I said before, plus the transaction fee, the PayPal transaction fee. So that's A2, open parentheses, A2 plus D2, okay, close parentheses, divided by, and in Excel, a division sign is a slash, open parentheses, one minus the eBay fee percentage which is B2 10% minus the PayPal fee percentage which is 2.9% and then close parentheses and I'll hit enter okay now I'm going to zoom back out so it's not so close and as you can see it calculates my break even based on this total cost to be fifty seven dollars and 75 cents now it's time to do a proof right uh, let's prove that this break-even actually works so here I'm going to put your price which is the price that you're going to charge then I'm going to put um, eBay fee 
PayPal fee and then I'll do the profit okay so your price will be let's just say your price is I'm gonna put a different price let's just say 60 okay just to show uh, in fact let's say your price was $100 all right your eBay fee would be equal to all right your price of $100 times okay the star is times in Excel the eBay fee percentage so your eBay fee would be ten dollars right your PayPal fee would be equal to your price times your PayPal fee percentage which is okay C2 plus your transaction fee okay plus your transaction fee which would only be three dollars and twenty cents okay that's your PayPal fee your profit all right will be equal to your price okay what you're charging minus okay I'm going to subtract your eBay fee minus again your PayPal fee okay and I'm just clicking on these numbers minus the original cost of the item I have to scroll back minus this total cost and that would be your profit 3680 now to prove that the break even works okay I'm gonna zoom out just one level here um, in fact I'll scroll over and then zoom back in control plus I'm going to set your price or my price equal to 57.75. I'm going to actually set it to the break even. And my profit should be zero when I do that. And you'll see that when I set my price to 57.75, in fact, my profit is zero. It is exactly zero. So this break even formula works. This break even formula is giving me the exact price that will give me exact zero profit right so I know that I will have to charge at least this much so now that means if I charge a little bit over break even like sixty dollars I should get like a small profit see that dollar one dollar ninety six cents okay that's what the break even does All right it gives me a minimum All right so I know I need to charge somewhere around sixty if I want to make a small profit all right, and if you change the original cost, now let's say you paid $100 for an item originally. It costs you $100 total. You see your break even is a lot higher, it's 115.15. Right? If you go underneath the break even, let's say you say, "Well, I'm only going to charge 110 for the item." You're going to see that your profit is negative, right? -4. 49 why because your break even is you have to charge at least the break even right if you charge the break even your profit is zero if you charge a little more you'll make more so that's basically the break even and that's how you would set up a spreadsheet to do it uh, however if your excel skills are not that strong or if you just don't want to actually build a spreadsheet I have a much more complete a uh, spreadsheet that includes this break-even price and improves all your profit calculations even includes things like shipping your shipping charge your buyer shipping charge I actually uh, added some of those other things into the break-even formula into the pr profit calculation which is on a uh, another channel that this channel derives from I'll include a link to that in this video where you can actually uh, subscribe to my list and actually get a copy of that uh, Google sheet and Excel sheet if you're interested uh, thanks for watching do subscribe to the channel feel free to leave any comments and suggestions below questions as well are all welcome thanks for watching this is mr. mark and thanks for being a part of excel for sellers take care and I'll see you in another video